Now continuing coverage with the latest from Cincinnati, our Isaac Petcash was there covering the game and watch the scene unfold. He now joins us outside of the medical center with the latest on DeMar Hamlin's conditions. Well, good afternoon. Obviously, as we continue here into the noon hour, still awaiting more updates on the health of DeMar Hamlin here outside the UC Medical Center. Throughout the day yesterday and into the morning today, Hamlin still in critical condition and updates have been coming in a slow trickle. We talked about this yesterday that really only two updates were issued, one by the Buffalo Bills talking about how Hamlin was admitted to the ICU both last night and now into this morning, meaning he's getting that intensive care around the clock by doctors and nurses to ensure if anything were to go awry with Hamlin, they are there by his bedside when necessary. So of course today is the day where a lot of people are hoping that the condition gets changed by Hamlin and maybe he moves into stable condition. But again, we're not going to stipulate that. We're not going to presume that. We're just going to wait updates as they come. Last night and over the course of the last two days, the community support has been incredible. Hamlin's family yesterday released a statement saying in part that they're thankful and gracious for the support and the thoughts and prayers that the community has given. Back in Buffalo, there was a vigil that was hosted here in Cincinnati, just outside the hospital to my right last night. About two dozen people showed up for a candlelit vigil for Hamlin as they tried to will him back to full health through their thoughts and through their prayers. Now, as we move throughout the day today, we are going to be departing Cincinnati here. There are, there's other business to attend to when it comes to the NFL season. And unfortunately, the world moves on, but we're not going to move on from this story. As we move throughout the day here on Erie News Now, we're going to be giving you recaps and updates as to everything that's going on. Just because we're not here in Cincinnati doesn't mean that we're going away from covering this story. I'm heading back to the station. I'll be on the first at 4 o'clock newscast and then on one of our early shows. If there are any developments in between then, we'll be certain to let you know. But as we sit here in the noon hour and as we await further updates, the status remains. Damar Hamlin in critical condition and the world watching and hoping that he recovers and recovers soon. Reporting from outside the UC Medical Center in Cincinnati, Ohio, Isaac Petcash, Erie News Now. Back to you.